heat wave in the western U. S fueled deadly wildfires in Northern California over the weekend, with residents continuing to brace for potential power outages on Labor Day and early this week as temperatures in some cities are predicted to climb even higher. This is the worst September heat wave. About 50 million. That's how many people were under excessive heat warnings, watches and heat advisories in the Western U. S on Friday just days after the heat wave began. The ongoing heat wave stretching from California to Montana that began August 30th has caused dozens of fires and has threatened energy supply and the health of millions of Americans. It is the latest in a series of heat waves in the region and across the U. As the summer, with several cities including Oakland, San Francisco, Phoenix, Seattle and Philadelphia breaking heat records. Officials in California and Nevada have urged residents to conserve energy to prevent power outages during the holiday week. As of Monday, the mill fire, meanwhile, was at 40% containment, according to California's wildfire tracking website, after spanning nearly 4,000 acres as of Friday. The western heat wave follows a host of other climate change induced extreme weather events this summer in the U.S., Europe and other parts of the world, including droughts, wildfires and floods. Scientists have warned that such weather events are expected to become increasingly common as humans navigate the effects of climate change. Unrelenting September heat wave grips California and western U.S. S. Washington Post truly dangerous heat wave breaks California temperature record. Two dead in mill fire, USA Today California braces for 115 degree weather over Labor Day weekend, with Death Valley forecasted to hit 124. Forms.